We've only ever seen this place up close once. That was in the 80s. It was captured by, it was captured. It was captured, we captured the moon. It is ours now. The photograph was captured by the Voyager probe we sent back in the fucking 60s. <laughs> then in July of 2006, the Hubble Space Telescope captured Ariel from far away. But it's not as cool as the Voyager picture. I mean, look at that fucking ship. And look at the fucking Hubble one. Like, <laughs> what are we doing here? Oh, it's a little dot. So imagine, right, you have an animal. And but specifically your pet. And they come and run up to you and put like their face in your face. That's how close the probe was to the fucking moon. The surface of Ariel has many craters and valleys. It's mostly neutral in color, whatever that means, <laughs> with a hint of red and blue in places. Oh, don't worry. Despite this place being over a billion miles away, everyone has to have things named after them. So, for... <laughs> God damn, why is there, why are these things named? <laughs> so for valleys, we have Leprechaun Valley and Sprite Valley. What the fuck? Uh, and then we have Brownie Chasm, Kupai Chasm, the Pixie Chasm. Wow, we named the chasms. Oh, and then for craters, we have things like Agape, Domovoy, Bafana, Gwen spelt with a W, Unaga, Rima, and Yangur. What if we needed something cool like Michael Jackson, P. Diddy? What are we fucking doing here? What is this nonsense? Stop it, get help. Oh my God, you don't need to name shit that's a billion miles away. 